What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my friends, subscribers, and welcome, 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 um, newbies. This is for the sign of Scorpio for September of 2022. This is to resonate if you have Scorpio in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Haven, or Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading for sign of Scorpio. Um, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel and thanks for all my new subscribers. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash, not no Venmo. This is, uh, it's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Um, I do not publicly display how much you donate, etc., etc., etc. if you choose to donate. Um, this resonates if you have Scorpio in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it does not apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. Okay, so um, I did receive two channel messages in as I was meditating on your energy, Scorpio. Um, this is a free general collective reading, so don't force anything that does, doesn't fit. Um, the first channel message I received was, um, mask off and I heard it big, like mask off. So, um, I, you know, energy is coming reverse. So I think you're, rip, you're ripping somebody's false mask off or they're ripping your false mask off because energy is coming reverse. I heard mask off, but I heard big, like mask off. So I think that's false mask energy. So only, you know, if you wear a false mask, not anybody else. So. Somebody's ripping the bitch off, basically. They're ripping the false mask off. Whether they're ripping it off you or you're ripping it off somebody else um, is what I'm feeling with the mask off. And the second one, I heard a significant um, naked photo of an adult, specifically I heard of an adult, is about to be um, sent around very viral. Um, I heard very immature people are about to send this around. It's meant to humiliate, but it's actually going to backfire. So you plug it in, how it resonates. That's pretty shifty, but um, people do do that crap, uh, like part part of like humiliation spells and crap like that, and that's just the truth. They do, um, and that's just the freaking truth. Um, I've never been a part of that, nor would I ever be a part of that, but people do do that for like humiliation and um, rituals and tactics and spells and things like that. Now, energy is being reversed, so it could be you as a naked adult, they're sending your naked photo around, or it could be somebody you're connected to naked, uh, maybe you're getting the naked photo sent to you, but um, I heard they were sending it around as far as a humiliation tactic, but it's about to backfire, and it should, it should, it should backfire, um, it should, because um, that's not right, and that's just the truth. I heard it's very immature people doing it. Now, you can be 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75 and be very immature. If you are a part of sending, I heard it's going to go viral um, in some community somewhere. So, if you're a part of sending this um, naked adult photo around, you're part of the toxicity. Now, if you receive it and you stop it, you break the chain if anybody needs to hear that, okay? For some, I feel it might be you, your naked body they're about to send around and want to hum humiliate you, but I don't know. Only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. If it is you they're sending around as part of a naked humiliation spell, I hope you catch them and I hope you sue them. And I'm just being for real. But you plug it in, how it resonates, okay? I do apologize if it's you that's getting sent around. Spirit messages you have signed Scorpio. We have seven of wands upright, two of wands reversed, nine of pinnacles upright. And ripping the mask off could be if you, if it's you, get, well, it could be either way. If you get sent this naked adult photo and you break the chain, maybe you're ripping somebody's mask off. Or if it's your photo, maybe you find it and you rip the mask off somebody that did it. Heavy humiliation rituals in here, heavy. Um, I honestly think somebody needs to reevaluate their friend circle. Um, I just intuitively feel this, but you plug it in, how it resonates. I feel for one of you guys, you have a toxic friend circle, or you're about to get around a toxic friend circle, and I'm just being for real. But you take it out, it resonates, okay? Vacation, triumph over troubles, obstacles, a stubborn, aggressive person, heartache over what you no longer have. Seven of Wands upright, two of Wands reversed, nine of Pentacles upright.
An earth sign has been blackmailing you and blackmailing you and blackmailing you. You're about to break the blackmail in a huge way. You haven't decided to do it yet, but through many series of chain of events, you're about to have a huge epiphany and you're about to do it. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Some kind of earth sign energy, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo energy. I feel for a lot of you guys, it could probably be a masculine earth sign. For some, it could be a fin that takes on heavy masculine. You plug the earth sign in how they resonate, Scorpio. They could have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Earth, and Midheaven, Jupiter charts. But I heard basically um, they've been blackmailing you. Uh, blackmailing you, blackmailing you, etc., etc., etc. I heard you haven't fully made up your mind yet to break the blackmail, but um, I heard some kind of epiphany. You're about to have some kind of epiphany through many series of chain events. I think the huge ass epiphany and wake up call, the Zinga moment or moments, is basically going to make um, cause you to break the blackmail because you haven't done it yet. It sounds like you're on the fence, and that would make sense with the Two of Wands reverse. But through many series of chain events, it sounds like about to be created in the universe with you and this earth sign is what I'm presuming. There's about to be some kind of bazinga moment, light bulb moment, epiphany or epiphanies that's about to make you wake up and break the blackmail. I heard it's going to cause you to go towards someone that this earth sign does not want you to go to go towards. Now, I don't know who the hell this earth, uh, who the person is the earth sign don't want you to go towards. Only you know who this earth sign doesn't want you to go towards. Um, Scorpio, but somehow something's about to be created in the universe that's going to wake your ass up and make you go towards uh, this person, whoever this person is, okay? And whoever the earth sign is. It can be a masculine or earth sign, but they're pulling up as a masculine earth sign, uh, um, knight of pinnacle. So uh, for some, it could be a younger person or just an immature earth sign. For some, it could be a fem. You plug it in, how it resonates, taking on heavy masculine. Vacation. An earth sign is about to get terminated through many series of chain events for theft in their workplace and drugs. Stealing drugs. For one, you're going to help with this termination. For one, you're going to be shocked. Oh, my God. Heavy earth sign energy in here. Heavy. They can have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and their uh, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and Midhaven, and Jupiter charts. Um, there's at least two of you guys, two of you Scorpios involved with this. For one, I heard you're going to help with the termination. Uh, for one, you're going to be shocked. You're going to be terminated. It could be mask or fem, um, earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. But I heard um, they're stealing drugs and they're stealing. So they're stealing from the company. I think things other than drugs and they're stealing drugs. So I feel they could work in pharmacy or healthcare or um, or something of that nature. Somewhere where there's drugs available and they have to have proper credentials to be around the drugs. How that resonates? It is an earth sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Uh, for one, you're going to help with termination. So I think you're about to catch them, or you already have. For one, um, you're going to be shocked. So whoever the earth sign is to you, okay? One Scorpio has already been on vacation. One is about to go. One Scorpio has already been on uh, vacation and one is about to go. So one of you guys has already been on vacation and one you're about to go. So you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. Triumph over troubles and obstacles. <clears throat> One particular Scorpio's online social media platform is really going nicely. Business is really upticking. However, you've already have gotten a huge influx of 
sexual innuendos behind the scenes, and you're about to get more. Through many series of chain events, one of these is going to really, 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 they're keeping screenshots. It's about to screw you up. They're keeping screenshots, sexual harassment, and they are planning this. Know this. Oh my God Almighty, you are a tarot card reader, masculine. Oh my God Almighty, you plug it in how it resonates. If that resonates for you, that could be standing up for yourself too. Maybe it's an earth sign doing this. Holy shit a moly. Um, somebody needs to be careful. You're a masculine Scorpio tarot card reader if this resonates for you. Um, hopefully your light side. Hell, I don't know. I didn't hear if you're light or dark, but you're definitely a, a tarot card reader. Whether you're, you're dark arts or light side or what have you, I didn't hear specifically. But your business is going. It's going. It's upticking. Um, you've had an increase in sales or revenue or... Whatever you're doing on your platform as a reader, uh, whether you offer services or you're just um, doing um, money on the back end with revenue, if you do a online, well, I heard you did do an online public platform, or you get donations, or um, you sell products, or what have you, what have you. Business is picking up, baby. It's picking up, okay? But whoever you are, you're a masculine tarot card reader, but you have a bunch of fems that... Um, you have a very heavy following, and you have a bunch of fems that follow you, basically. And that's just the truth. Um, so much so, you've already gotten lots of, it sounds like communication from, it sounds like your clientele, fem clientele, already sexual innuendos and sexual offerings of sex and sexual propositions and sex, sex, sex from all these fem clients. Um, but... I heard one of them is screenshotting every single conversation. I feel for some, it could be an earth sign. I didn't hear it was, but I feel for some, it could be. Um, and I heard it's about to backfire on you because um, they're planning on a sexual harassment suit against you. So I think you really like this person, but I think they know it. And I think you, somebody needs to be careful. Whoever you are, it's your masculine uh, tarot card reader. I think you initiate a lot with the, this person. I think you initiate a lot with this person. I really think you like this person. It could be a masculine or feminine or um, whoever it is. I feel it's our sign, but it really could be any sign. But whoever this person is, I think you initiate, initiate, you really like them. But they're snowing you over. I heard they're planning a sexual harassment lawsuit on your ass. So really, what they want is the money from you. But you don't know this because you're so infatuated with them. But Whoever you are, it's not just this person you're interested in. Many other fans. I think it's a fam. I think it's a fam um, that's screenshotting all these um, sexy type conversations between you and her is what I feel. Um, it could be masculine, but I feel it's a fam. But you, it's not just her. I think you're interested in her, but you have all these other fans coming at you, coming at you, coming at you sexually. But there's one I think you keep initiating with. She's screenshotting that shit. Somebody needs to be careful. You're a masculine tarot card reader. Triumphs over troubles and obstacles. I think it's identifying who you're having a conversation with. Because somebody's screenshotting some shit for sexual harassment suit. And I'm just being for real. They have so much evidence for many series of chain events. They're about to go to a lawyer. It's not going to go well for you because it's already happened in the universe. Oh, my God. Whoa. I heard they have so much evidence. Whoa. Okay. Oh, my God. I heard they already have it. They already have it. It's not going to go well for you. They're about to go to a lawyer, um, whoever you are. They already have it. You've already communicated very sexually with them. I feel sexting. I feel sexting and very explicit. Um, but whoever you are, it's not just this person you've been communicating with like that. You, I mean, there's lots of women coming at your ass. But this one is not playing games. I heard she's about to go to a lawyer soon. You know, intuitively, it is karma because of the past. And it is. Oh, my God. I heard you know intuitively it's karma because of the past, and it is. So something to do with some kind of sexual harassment suit is some kind of 
karma for a masculine uh, Scorpio tarot card reader because of the past. I heard she's about to go to a lawyer soon, uh, Scorpio. She already has it, so whoever that's for. But it's not just her you're communicating with. It's a shit ton of females. Um, and you've been getting a lot of donations. A lot of donations. Some of these are about to stop soon. They're not getting what they want. Oh, my God. And I heard you've been getting a lot of donations, a lot of donations recently, but they're about to stop soon because they're not getting what they want. So somebody's been donating to your tarot card reading channel, whoever you are, Mask on Scorpio, but I heard they're, uh, and it sounds like you've been getting quite a few donations, but I heard they're about to stop because, uh, some of them are about to stop. Some of them are about to stop because whoever has been donating to you, they're not getting what they want in some shape or fashion, so they're, um, the donations are about to stop. You okay, buddy? So you plug it in how it resonates, okay? A stubborn, aggressive person. <clears throat> a lawyer is about to come. An absolute headache in your life. An absolute headache. For some, a guardian ad litem. For some, another another lawyer. Oh, my God. Okay, so for some of you guys, a guardian ad litem is about to become an absolute headache in your life. And for some, it's another type of lawyer. There's many types of lawyers. There's property law and uh, family law, family court. And there's um, there's many. There's many. A criminal, um, civil, probate. Um, there's lots of type of law. Um, so... For one of you guys that's a guardian ad litem, that's a child's lawyer or a children's lawyer. For one of you guys, it is um, another type of lawyer. I heard there, whether it's a guardian ad litem, masculine or feminine guardian ad litem, child's lawyer, or somebody else's lawyer, um, they're about to become an absolute headache in your life. So a stubborn, aggressive person in this aspect is a guardian ad litem, masculine or feminine, or a, um, another type of lawyer. They're about to become an absolute headache in your life. Uh, I think they're going to be very stubborn and aggressive, maybe um, towards communication or something else that's about to um, uh, be a headache in your life in some shape or fashion, uh, Scorpio. Um, hopefully, you can triumph over that. Uh, maybe it's going to make you want to take a vacation, possibly. You plug it in how it resonates, okay? But heavy legal issues coming for some of you guys, or you're already in them, how that resonates. Or regarding a guardian ad litem, some other kind of lawyer in some aspect, whether it's property law or um, probate or civil or criminal or what have you, what have you, okay? Heartache over what you no longer have. A Libra is about to contact you soon. They live at a distance from you. A very specific letter. It's regarding money. And feelings. Okay. A Libra is about to contact you. They live at a distance from you. Uh, I heard it's the Libra feminine. Libra Femme. Um, they're about to contact you. They live at a distance from you, Scorpio, if this resonates for you. They live at a distance from you. I heard it's going to be a letter. So uh, I feel in United States Postal Service energy. For some, it could be certified mail. Uh, I'm, I feel in physical letter here. For some, it could be an email letter. Uh, you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard letter. So I'm thinking uh, United States Postal Service or certified mail via United States Postal Service or an email letter. Um, however that resonates with some kind of letter energy, they're about to, it sounds like they're going to contact you, Scorpio. It is a Libra feminine. She could have Libra in her Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Wolf, Moon, Hey, Red, Jupiter, Charts. I heard it's uh, over money and feelings. But it's with the heartache over what you no longer have. So I think there might be some kind of lost business investment or lost money or going to be lost money or business investment or... Something regarding loss of money in the past or upcoming and something to do with feelings. Maybe you used to date this person or be in a sneaky link or a third party or situationship with this person or what have you, what have you. It's over money and feelings. Maybe it's their feelings over the money loss or upcoming money loss or maybe it's a love letter. Um, I feel for some it could be a love letter. For some it could be they're angry over 
a lost investment, or both. However that resonates, okay? For some, they could be a stubborn, aggressive person. Maybe that's, um, they live at a distance from you, so there's a reason you guys have not connected. There's a reason they're about to send this communication now. So I feel for some, you might have had problems with this person in the past, possibly, with it being a stubborn, aggressive person here. Uh, I think you might have had to stand up to this person, possibly, but you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio, okay? A death is very significant in a Scorpio's life. For one, it's already happened. For one, it's about to happen. A death is very significant in a Scorpio's life. For one, you guys, the death has already happened. For one, it's about to happen. So you plug it in how it resonates, Scorpio. Some kind of death energy. That could be the heartache over what you no longer have. Um, that physical death in this aspect. Um, for one, the death has already happened. Already happened. For one, it's about to um, however that resonates and applies in your life. For some, the person that passed away could have been a stubborn, aggressive person, possibly, possibly. You plug it in, how it resonates. For one, this is your father. For one, it is a childhood friend. For one, it's a former lover. The former lover's death is about to shock the hell out of you. That has not happened yet. Crash. Very serious crash. Oh, my God. Whoa. Okay, so for some of you guys, it's your father. Whether your father's already passed away or they're about to pass away. For some, it's a childhood friend. Whether they've already passed away or they're about to pass away. For one of you guys, it's a lover. The lover has a former lover. I heard a former lover. So you're not in current sexual energy with them right now, but you used to be. Um... I heard they have not passed away yet, but they're about to, and I heard that's about to shock the hell out of you. I heard very serious crash. So some kind of very serious crash is coming regarding your former lover. Um, you used to be in sexual connection with them, but you're not now. Um, whatever the serious crash is and however that resonates and applies, okay, Scorpio, it has not happened yet, but it's a former lover, masculine or femme, former lover. Um, however that resonates and applies, Scorpio, okay? But heavy funeral energy here, heavy funeral, okay? There is about to be huge changes here. Huge, huge, huge changes. There's about to be huge changes here. Huge, huge, huge changes. For one, you have money you're not supposed to have, and through many series of chain events, it's about to be given up. There's about to be huge changes here, and for one of you guys, you have money you're not supposed to have, and for many series of same events, it's about to be given up. So you plug it in, how it resonates, Scorpio. So 555 change energy, that can be positive or negative. Only you know which side of the karmic wheel you're on, not anybody else. Um, and for one of you guys, um, you have money you're not supposed to have, and I heard for many series of same events, you're about to be forced to give it up, whether you want to or not. For one, it's to local police. For one, it's to a lawyer. For one is to local police, for one is to a lawyer. So for one of you guys, this uh, money you have, you're not supposed to have. You're uh, going to have to give it up to local police. And for one is to a lawyer. So I think the local police might be stubborn and aggressive trying to get the money back. Um, possibly. Um, I don't I don't know why police would come to you asking you for money unless you got money on the back end, paid under the table for some dirty cops or something. For some, it could be that, possibly. I have been pulling that in my energetic spaces. But you plug it in, how it resonates. Only you know if you've accepted money from dirty cops and dirty precincts in the past or not, okay? Um, and uh, from one, it's a lawyer. A lawyer. You're about to get communication. This lawyer is very significant in here for some of you guys. For some, it's a guardian ad litem. For some, it is a uh, another kind of lawyer. But um, I think they're about to send you pretty aggressive communication regarding having to give up this money. I heard you're not going to want to have to give it up, but you're about to have to give it up. So you plug it in how it resonates, it resonates and that could be the heartache over what you no longer have, this money, whether it was um, you having to give up to the police or this lawyer. Flow, number 24, could be very significant number in one's life, number 24, flow.
A Scorpio is about to reveal everything they know. Everything they know. Through many series of chain of events. One is about to be interrogated. One is about to be questioned. One is about to free willingly contact people and speak on the past. Healing. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. Some kind of healing energy. I think you're going to promote healing in yourself is what I think, Scorpio. For one of you guys, you're about to be interrogated. For one, you're about to be um, questioned. So I think maybe by the police or by somebody else or an investigator or something. But one interrogation. So I'm thinking like actual interrogation room energy I'm feeling. Um, it could be feds. It could be local police. It could be investigators. I don't know. But some kind of interrogation room energy for one. Hasn't happened yet. It don't sound like. But you're about to. It doesn't sound like you're going to hold it in. It sounds like you are going to. You're gonna you're gonna spill it. You're gonna spill the beans. But for some, it could be a confession. I didn't hear it was, but it could be confession, maybe, or just spilling the beans with the flow energy. You're not gonna be stubborn to hold it in. Uh, whoever that's for. Um, one is questioning, so that could be from anybody. Uh, I feel it could be from anybody. You're gonna be questioned. You're gonna flow. You're gonna spill the beans. For um, you did not in the past, but you're about to. You did not in the past, but you're about to. So you did not spill the beans, flow the information, or confess in the past, but you're about to. That resonates, okay? It sounds like you've been holding it in, and that could be the healing, too. Um, I feel for some, it might have created mental health issues, having a whole, uh, I think you might know about crime or crimes, or been connected to crime or crimes, or committed crimes or crimes, and basically you just want to clean slate and just um, come forth with whatever the hell happened in the past, basically. If that resonates and applies, okay? Which is going to create healing in you and flow of information and flow, um, I think, help you. Help you um, if that resonates, okay? Um, which is beautiful. And that promotes healing. That promotes healing, absolutely. And for some, it is um, you free willingly communicating, uh, con you contacting someone from your past. And for some, I feel it could be two or two plus people from your past and flowing and spilling the beans and communicating to promote some kind of something that happened in the past that was very toxic, basically, to promote healing. So flow energy for you. Um, for some, you could I feel you could be sad over something that happened in the past, um, the heartache energy. Um, it, I think it was something very traumatic, or it could be it could be about the death, possibly for some. It could be about the death, or about something that is traumatic that has happened to you or somebody else in your past. How that resonates and applies, Scorpio. Okay. Um, it's nice to see the healing energy. It's very nice to see healing energy. Let me see if I hear anything else. A sorcery shop, magic shop, it's about to become very significant in Scorpio's life. And a sex shop. Okay. Um, a, a, a magic shop, sorcery, magic shop, and a sex shop is about to become very significant in Scorpio's life. Um, hopefully you don't do hoodoo, voodoo, dark arts, what have you, what have you, but hell, I don't know. Um, I know I'll pull in a mixture of light and dark energies in here, so for some, you have to plug yourself in wherever you are at there, Scorpio. Hopefully you're not using um, on the dark side, but I don't know, okay? I love you guys. Everybody have a good day. If you like the book of personal reading, the information is in the description box below. Um, I cannot guarantee spiritual downloads. Um, spirit only gives what spirit only wants to give, okay? I love you guys so much. Everybody have a good day and namaste.